we can find our security in our unchanging God. Welcome to today's DDRX. Our prescription is still the secret place. The secret place is a place of security. A place of security. Psalm 91, 5 to 8. You shall not be afraid of the terror by night, nor of the arrow that flies by day, nor of the pestilence that walks in darkness, nor of the destruction that lays waste at no day. A thousand may fall at your side, and ten thousand at your right hand, but it shall not come near you. Only with your eyes shall you look and see the reward of the wicked. So we are safe and secure in the secret place. You know, we live in a world where values, morals, laws, people, and government change constantly. But we can find our security in our unchanging God. You know, in the secret place, God does not change. I have a narrative for us in Psalm 61, 1 to 4. Hear David, hear my cry, O God, attend to my prayer. From the end of the earth, I will cry to you. When my heart is overwhelmed, lead me to the rock that is higher than I. For you have been a shelter for me, a strong tower from the enemy. I will abide in your tabernacle forever. I will trust in the shelter of your wings. You know, David wrote this psalm when he was running away from his son, Absalom. He cried to God and God showed up for him because Absalom rebelled and was all out to kill him. But David found his security in God. David knows that lasting security is found only in the shelter of the wings of God, which is the secret place. You see, our job, our savings, our house, our pension plan, our relationship, our family, our own skills and abilities cannot offer us true security. I don't want you to rely on earthly things in seasons like this. Real security is found in closeness with God, in dwelling in the sacred place. I want to encourage you, dwell in the sacred place and you'll find real security there. Thank you.